Sally, you're in Oakdean. Uh, you had an absent father. How did it affect you? Hi, Bungani. How are you? I'm well. I'm well, Sally. Thank you for asking. Go ahead. Mine is actually very interesting because my father was very present but very absent. Yeah. So, being married to my mother for over 40 years, so he lived with us in the household, but I never really got to experience him because he was very disengaged. So the psychological part that I actually realize with me now almost turning 40 is that I was always looking for my father in my relationships. So the people that I dated, I actually realized now that I was not actually looking for a lover, but I was actually more looking for my absent father who's actually present in my household. But, well, fortunately enough for me, I studied psychology and I started to actually <laughs> diagnose myself. And understand and these I, things. And Yes, and I understand this thing, but that is a psychological effect because I was not actually um, interested to my age group type of. So everybody that was about 10 years, 15 years older, those were my people. Sally, and most of them, yes. Was it because he was just busy? Was it career? What was, do you, can you explain what you call his disengagement? He was just there, you know, no career, nothing. He was just there in the house, you know, those like your township sometimes, not everybody before the township people kill me. You know, those fathers that we live in this household, uh, there is a mother and a father inside the house. He goes, by the newspaper, sits there, watches TV, wait for his plate to come from the wife, and then, yeah, we go to sleep. The following morning is like the same. The routine is the same, nothing really. Oh, wow. <laughs> like, yeah. Oh, so Sally, extremely- yeah, look, yeah. it affects us in all kinds of ways, hey, and we don't always even realize it at the time. That certainly is true. Current events, developing stories, tough questions, your voice making a difference. This is Breakfast with Bongani Bingwa.